Hi, man. <laughs> Hi, my name is Josh Ashby, and this is my five side team. Uh, best player I've played with probably uh, John Lundstrom when I was my time at Oxford United. Um, I was only young coming through, and yeah, he was in my position unfortunately, so it was hard to get ahead of him. But yeah, what a player! He, he could play off both feet, always demanding the ball. Did 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 the dirty side of the game really well, and he's gone on to have a great career as well. So yeah, he's definitely the definitely the best player. against uh, a few toughies I'm going to try and relate it to five side though so the best player I've played against would be Ruben Diaz who played Benfica B team when they were on tour at St George's Park and they had I think he played Renato Sanchez played um, but yeah if I'm thinking five side I'd, I'd, I'd say Ruben Diaz um, played against Van Dyke as well for when he was at Southampton when uh, I think he just signed there and they were coming through, um, they had an international duty so we played there, kind of lads that didn't go and um, yeah he, he was a joke and he smiled, but he smiled lovely. <laughs> oh, he, he just stood out, he was, he was a monster at the time, um, sent off, I think we lost 4-0, four, four I think mean, the clips are still on YouTube as well so I want to try and look at them when I get home but yeah he, he was just so composing the ball, a monster and yeah just, just stood out, head and shoulders above everyone else. player from Oxford City's uh, first team now that I'd include in my five side team would definitely be Zach McEachern. Um I think he'd be a very popular choice. Uh, five side definitely suits him, you won't be able to get the ball off him. Um, and probably one of the best players I've ever played with. Um, so technically gifted and just his ability to get out of any situation and yeah, he's, he's magic. Childhood hero that would be in my father's side team would be Thierry Henry, media striker as well. So yeah, I used to grow up watching watching Arsenal. My old man tried to to get me into West Ham, but uh, they, they were poor at the time. So yeah, Thierry Henry. Um, yeah, he was unreal. I need to be fair. I have him at Bergkamp. Um, but yeah, going forward, obviously electric pace, power, um, scored shed loads of goals, and yeah, one of my best players I've ever seen. Am I in this? Yeah. Big piece of quality there. Um, I'm going to go, so obviously Diaz at the back is going to be a bit of a sweeper keeper. Um, we'll go Lundstrom in the middle, me and Zach to the right and left, and then Henri up front. Yeah, the man, uh, probably two managers have the biggest influence in my career, probably Chrissy Allen. So firstly, Chrissy Allen, when uh, my time as a youth team at Oxford, um, yeah, he, he really taught me kind of the discipline and what it needs to be a player, really, at a decent level. Um, yeah, great coach, always, always had a set of sessions, um, taught me a lot of technical detail about the game. Um, so Chrissy Allen, and then the second would be Mickey Lewis. He was uh, assistant coach when I was a, a pro at Oxford. And um, he just had a kind of a one a natural talent of just getting you up for any session, even if it was pissing down in rain in December and it was minus five. You'd walk out and you'd hear his voice, and all of a sudden you bang up for training. Um, and again, a great coach, great guy. I worked with him down here, and um, yeah, a real big influence on not just my playing career but also my coaching career too. Um, uh, the city ground. Not in the forest. We played a like a county, you know, the county teams when you were younger. Um, played a, like a final there for the county against Durham. I think we won like six three or something. Uh, yeah, that was a special day playing there. Uh, lovely, decent ground to be fair. Pitch was nice. Um, yeah, probably the best best stadium. Yeah. First kit. 
I reckon it was the one of the Arsenal ones, the O2 sponsor. Do you remember the purple one? The purple with the, with the gold, right? So yeah, my first kit would be the Arsenal O2 sponsored one. The, I think the purple one is like a purple burgundy one, away kit, uh, or the red one. Get on the back. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so Oxygen Nuts of my way kit would be Oxygen United um, home kit when we played Exa in 2015, I believe. League game, we drew 2 2. Um, yeah, that would be my uh, away kit. I remember there being 2 1 down in the 90th minute, and James Roberts, who played here for a bit, come on and, and equalised. I remember my preparation for the, the game that day weren't the best. I didn't think I was even going to be in the squad. So on the Friday night, I um, I was out and about, mucking about with my mates until God knows when. I turned up on a Saturday for pre-match, and my name was on the sheet. And uh, yeah, panic stations. But it was probably the best way to make your debut, to be honest. Maybe. I spoke with Brad earlier. He's got a good team. Brad's got a good team. I'd say... I think one of the boys has been, a, been at a decent club. Cardo. It was time at Palace. Probably got a decent... Probably played a lot of Premier League sides as well. I'll go Brad or Cardo, but I feel like I'm missing someone here.